Hey y'all, wanted to come to you today and give you a quick just wake up flow that you could do anywhere, anytime, but to really wake up your body. Maybe you even do this in the afternoon when your body's feeling tired and you need just a body, mind, and spirit revival. So first thing I wanna do is just have you think about a focus word that you can breathe in throughout the practice today. My word this morning is gonna be peace. So I'm going to head down to child's pose. We're gonna start in child's pose. So take the hips back close to the heels, sink in to the left and to the right and just center your mind here. Take a big deep inhale in and fill up the back the whole body, and then exhale, release. And then big, deep inhale in. And then a big, deep exhale. And then starting our first set of flow, we'll start in all fours, we'll tuck the toes under, and then we'll press back to downward facing dog, alternating the right heel down and the left heel down, shaking out anything you need to shake out. And then inhale, come back to all fours. Exhale to child's pose. Every inhale in that you do, breathe in your word. Continue to move to the rhythm of your breath. We're gonna go through each flow series five times. Every inhale in, you breathe in your focus word. Bring your thoughts back into your mind and into your body and stay present right here on your mat. Use the time to renew your mind. Last one, and then we are going to finish in downward facing dog. Shake the head side to side. Again, maybe move the hips, the legs, left and right. And then take an inhale in and look to the front of the mat. Pull in the low belly, stretch, press the palms in, step, walk, or lightly jump your feet to the front of your mat. Drop the head down. And then inhale and lift the chest. Hands come to the shins and then exhale down. And then bend the knees, circle the arms up, reach up high. And then exhale, fall all the way down. Inhale, look up. Exhale, come down to the ground, hands down. And then step walk or lightly jump your feet back to your strong plank. And let's take our first very slow vinyasa flow here. So slow upward facing dog or cobra here. Elbows hug in and then head down. Push up through the knees, and then you can press back to downward facing dog. Look up to the front of the mat. Gently step, walk, or jump your feet up. Hamstrings are loosening up. Look up, fall down, bend the knees. Root to rise with intention and breathe back in your focus word. And then exhale, fall all the way down. Inhale, look up, exhale down. Step, walk, or lightly jump your feet back. Strongest plank. Inhale to upward facing dog. Exhale to downward facing dog. Again, starting to build a little bit of heat, a little fire in the body. Again, breathing in your focus word. Every breath in. Exhaling out whatever it is you need to release. Being proud of yourself for making five minutes in your day to do something good for your body. Okay, so once you've done five of those, you're gonna come into the last flow series. Lift the right leg, slowly bring it in between the hands, low lunge, turn the back foot, rise up to warrior one, and then bring the hands down to frame the knee. Take the vinyasa. Inhale to upward facing, exhale to downward facing, and then the left leg comes up and then swings in between the legs, the hands, and you rise up. Take this at your own pace and continue to flow through each side, waking up the body, waking up the mind, 
renewing the spirit. Christ came to give us life and life to the fullest. That is why we are working to wake up not only our bodies, but our minds, our spirits through movement. Allow the movement, allow the flow just to awaken you. Going to go through one more on either side, stretching, lengthening the body, each time getting deeper into the posture. Body and hips are waking up, shoulders, upper back, lower back. Last one on the left leg. Slowly rise up. Biggest inhale. Biggest exhale. And finish in the downward facing dog. Reset, renew. Drop to knees. And then finish how you started in child's pose. <laughs> 